Hello everyone! So, this is a quick um, Creator Studio tutorial. So, as you can see, okay, may page restriction tayo. You know how crazy Facebook is now. Okay, so I use Creator Studio mainly to um, schedule content for Facebook and Instagram. I usually check if they're connected, but there are other accounts that can't be connected depending on paano nyo siya set up. So, make sure when you set up your Facebook and Instagram, malinas yung pagkakagawa niya. And, um, maayos kasi kailangan mo i-check kung mabilis ba siyang makakalink sa accounts. So, for this one, I only have 8 profiles connected to Instagram. While, I have 60, 65 pages na Facebook. In terms of scheduling, what I do is I just click on create post. Um, if it's an Instagram post, you create Instagram feed. As IGTV, pwede mo rin siyang schedule. So you just have to click on that one. And then choose the account where you want to post. So for example, Z Studios. So make sure that you have um, available content to post, syempre. So mas maganda kung meron ka ng calendar. So, if that's the case, okay, kunwari, let's showcase this one. Showcasing one of our clients and their sense for the holidays collection. Available by the serenity list. And then put some emojis for me. When I do emojis, I have a nap. So, emoji, Christmas tree. Oh, there we go. You can put in some hashtags. So, digital marketing. Nag-auto nga pala siya. Sorry. Hindi, babe. I'm recording. Social media. Okay. So, once you're done with that one, you can put in some location here. Um, this usually, I usually do this for, um, other clients, okay, but for sample purposes, let's do that one. So, pwede marin i-turn off yung commenting kung meron kang kailangan i-describe for the advanced settings, you can put on this one. But, for the normal post and all, yan yan. You can also do in, um, pwede multiple photos din naman. You just have to click on the different photos all together. So here you can see it's already connected to Facebook. So what's good here is that you just have to schedule in one go. Kasi you check mo lang to and then make sure you select schedule to schedule the post. So for example, this works out tomorrow at 6 a.m. So that's for the Facebook side and then this lower button is for the Instagram side. You just have to check again the date and the time. And then, and that's it. You're good to go. It's already scheduled. Okay, so for this one, as you can see, sobrang daming, um, pwede mo i-check yung status ng post. So you can check all the scheduled ones as you want. So wala sa amin, isa lang. Kasi sobrang dire-direct yung content every day kami nag-create ng content. Pero you can also check yung mga published na and then you just have to make sure na correct na sa correct um, account po siya na publish. Plus you can also check it per type of post, so you can check all the videos here, and then photos, carousels, carousels are the swipe things, even swipe right, swipe left. 
good stories. Stories are very, very important now, by the way. And IGTV. Wala kaming pinapost na IGTV content for the client, so that's it. Yun lang. Um, if you're gonna check in if your account is connected, you just click on Instagram account, and then you can easily add an Instagram account. There's gonna be like um, a notification if hindi siya directly connected to Facebook, so make lang lang kayo ka use it. Okay, so this was a quick video for Creator Studio. I was doing it for one of our new social media managers for Z Studios. So might as well do it for everyone. Why I like Creator Studio, yung reasons mainly yung isa doon is yung pagiging efficient yeah in terms of posting compared to later HubSpot and everything else that I need to relink and relink the account. Um ito yung pinaka efficient for me. Kasi gawa siya ni Facebook. So, isa yun sa main reasons why I use Creator Studio. Plus, it's automatically linked up na. As in, may ikiklik ka lang yung dinascuss ko kanina. Ikiklik mo lang dun sa Instagram um, side pag nag-schedule ka. Diretso na siya ma-schedule for Facebook. Um, ang problem ko lang dito for Creator Studio, yun nga yung dinascuss ko kanina. Sometimes, medyo mahirap mag-link or mag-add ng Instagram account sa Creator Studio, especially if magkaiba yung gumawa ng page and ng Instagram. Most of the time, nangyayari yun kapag, kunwari, na-setup ng way ahead yung Facebook page, tapos hindi ka agad na-link yung um, Facebook and Instagram. It sometimes gets an error, pero kung uulitan mo lang yung process, you can do it on the page side. As in, um, you have to connect the Instagram from the page settings. Or you can do it via the Instagram account. So, yun lang. Um, other than that, I super love Creator Studio. Although, I don't use it for insights. Um, I still use the insights page or ads manager if I'm doing ads. Mas okay pa din yun. You can also check the insights for Instagram. Diretso yung insights na link click dun. And then, other than that, okay na ho dun. So, if you are pushing for scheduling your content, uh, might as well use Creator Studio. So, yun lang. It was a quick video. Hope this can help you schedule your content more efficiently.